Hey y'all, it's the Southern Woods here. Welcome to another World Royale simulation video with Ages of Conflict. This time around, we have all the big fast food chains becoming their own nation. 32 of them to be exact. We have the big hitters like McDonald's and Wendy's and Burger King, all the way to some smaller seeds like Del Taco and Freddy's. So, how I did this map is I got all these uh, fast food chains and placed them in their starting location based off their founding location in real life. You can see there's several located in Georgia. Uh, McDonald's was founded in Illinois. Starbucks founded in Washington. And some of these will have a terrain advantage. For example, Burger King and Starbucks, they're kind of cut off by the ocean when I grew their terrain, grew their territory. And some of them are larger than others, and that's based on total revenue. So for example, McDonald's about the largest, and then you have the smaller ones being smaller because, well, their revenue is less. So that's kind of how I did it. We're going to simulate this and see which fast food chain would take over America if they assembled all their workers into soldiers and battled it out. So we are going to start this up right now. Um, as you can see, they're all grabbing up territory. Uh, the ones out west are going to get a lot larger quicker. Uh, just because of how the territory is and how the map is white castle may be the first to fall they are they're conquered by freddy's there's still some land being eaten up in the midwest uh starbucks dairy queen panda express gonna get a lot of that it seems uh we have some contentious battle around appalachia in the southeast a and w con conquered by captain d's and arby's conquered by crystal so a few are already out uh, Long John Silver's was also conquered by Wendy's. I didn't see that before. We have five guys moving up into Duncan territory. Duncan has a firm control of the far northeast. Hardy's taken out by Bojangles in former North Carolina. Meanwhile, Raisin Cane's conquered by McDonald's, which is moving down south into Louisiana. Already we have 26 uh, fast food chains left. Looks like Steak and Shake actually pushing back Wendy's a little bit up here um, around uh, Michigan, it looks like. Meanwhile, we have McDonald's moving into Freddy's. They're going to take out Freddy's. Sonic's going to get a little, bit as, a little bit of that as well. We have Zaxby's moving up into Kentucky trying to take out the Colonel. You'd think the Colonel would have good military strategy. I guess not. Zaxby's took them out. They're looking a little weird. We have 24 fast food chains already. Let's look at the statistics. Sonic is the largest by area out here in the Midwest, followed by McDonald's, then Dairy Queen and Starbucks. Let's look at the um, gold, though. Starbucks is the richest, followed by Chick-fil-A down here, which is kind of from Atlanta all the way to uh, northern Florida. And then we have Five Guys being the third best economy. All right, let's continue. All right, wow, Church's Chicken conquered by Whataburger. They have supreme control of Texas. But meanwhile, Crystal taken out by Checkers in the gray. And Popeye's also taken out by Checkers. Wow. Three went down very quickly. Put in the comments, what is your favorite fast food chain? Who do you want to win? McDonald's, wow. The Juggernaut, the biggest one of them all. Taken out by Captain D's out of all. Uh fast food chains. Wow, so Captain D's has a strong, strong control of this uh, middle Mississippi. I imagine they're going to try to get the Port of New Orleans soon if Whataburger doesn't get there first. Meanwhile, Bojangles struggling over here in North Carolina. Big contentious war. Bojangles will fall to Zaxby's. They're going to get some more territory. Uh, who's this? Cookout. Cookout's barely surviving in former South Carolina. What is your least favorite fast food chain as well? Who do you want to lose? Maybe they've already been knocked out. Hey, check this out. Duncan's kind of crept into Wendy's territory. They've hopped borders a little bit. Meanwhile, Steak and Shake was conquered by Captain D's, who is looking a little bit formidable. Whataburger pushing up north, trying to take out Sonic, which they will. Dairy Queen's going to get a lot of that territory. A lot of it. Meanwhile, we just had Chick-fil-A, probably a fan favorite, as well as Cookout Falls. So Zaxby's and Burger King's going to get bigger. Burger King has almost full control of uh, Florida. Wow. 
We have 15 nations left all of a sudden. Things have gone by quickly. Dairy Queen is the largest, followed by Whataburger and Panda Express. Looking at the economy, Starbucks still the richest, followed by Zaxby's and then Culver's, actually. So, already halfway done. What will happen next? There hasn't been many uh, deaths out in California, although there have been battles. Meanwhile, Wendy's conquered by Zaxby's, which is moving north. Wow, Zaxby's kind of a dark horse here. We have some big ones already gone. McDonald's, Wendy's. Uh, Burger King has a semi-advantageous position uh, to defend. Meanwhile, Duncan just got beaten by five guys, which will have supreme control of the Northeast. And Del Taco was kicked out by Jack in the Box, who is going to get more of California. Wow. So Taco Bell is the only taco chain left. Meanwhile, we have Panda Express conquered by Jack in the Box, which is now... Uh, Going on a full-on onslaught, Taco Bell is going to get a lot of that. I mean, it's going to be a four-way race, actually. Oh, now Jack in the Box has its eyes on Taco Bell. And it looks like they may be able to knock him out. They do. Jack in the Box is on a fucking tear right now. Wow. However, Whataburger and Dairy Queen is going to get a lot of that. Meanwhile, a lot of action going on out east, but not a lot of... Uh, conquering as of right now checkers fighting off whataburger and burger king at the same time uh very impressive meanwhile burger king decides that it'll try to go up the savannah river and try to uh take out zaxby's or at least make them move their capital see how that goes meanwhile dairy queen flooding into whataburger territory reach texas zaxby's did have to change its capital uh-oh burger king now having uh, advantage over checkers they're gonna take out checkers and get a lot of Alabama and Mississippi even some of uh, Louisiana meanwhile both Culver's and Burger King turning on Captain D's Captain D's you know they weren't allowed to make it in the top 10 <laughs> but they did so shout out to Culver's Zaxby's five guys Burger King Captain D's Whataburger uh, Jack in the Box Starbucks and if I didn't say Dairy Queen Dairy Queen as well all the top nine. What will happen next? All right, we have several people turning on Zaxby's, Culver's, and Burger King. Captain D's trying to move out west against the Dairy Queen. You know, they won't notice a little bit of land being taken, right? Meanwhile, what a burger. Uh, teaming up with Captain D's to push out Wendy's as well as Jack in the Box. Everyone's turning on Wendy's. Or not Wendy's, fucking Dairy Queen. I'm so sorry, Dairy Queen. Straight up disrespect out of, uh, from my, wow. Fuck. <laughs> uh, so Dairy Queen, barely alive in this portion. Their capital is just gone, I guess. I, I don't know, um, what's happening with them. A lot's happening now. Meanwhile, Captain D's, they're gonna be taken out as well, probably, there's some Dairy Queen and Captain D's left in the Midwest, northern Texas. And all of a sudden, this has uh, become very crazy. Zaxby's barely hanging on over here. What is this? I don't even know. These fast food chains got me messed up. Zaxby's is done. They're officially out of here. We have Starbucks in a big war with Culver's. They do have some uh, territory split off from themselves. None of these fast food chains want to give up. The final eight not wanting to give up. We still have Dairy Queen and Captain D. Whoa, Captain D's flooding into Culver's. Meanwhile, Whataburger, I think, officially took out Dairy Queen now. And then, wow, Culver's conquered officially by five guys. And then Burger King conquered by five guys. And then Whataburger flooding into what's left of Captain D surviving up here. And now into Starbucks. Whoa. Things happen fast. And now five guys turning on Whataburger. It looks like Captain D's is officially over. Um, wow. So we have Jack in the Box, Starbucks, Whataburger, and five guys left. Wow. Wow. Who will be the ultimate fast food chain? Will it be 
Five Guys? Will it be Jack in the Box? Will it be Whataburger? Will it be Starbucks? Whoa, what happened? Oh, I guess Captain D's wasn't done. I don't know how that happened. What the hell is going on? Whataburger's done. Captain D's flood. <laughs> Try to really take out Jack in the Box and Starbucks at the same time. Meanwhile, Five Guys. Oh my gosh. Five Guys must have five million soldiers. They're moving across the country at rapid speed. I am bewildered right now. At just what the heck is going on. Now we have Starbucks. Pushing in strong. Starbucks has made it to the Mississippi. And Jack in the Box had to move its capital. They're not looking too good. And we still have Captain D's now, which is on the complete opposite side of the country, which it started from. Captain D's, Captain D's is the one taking out Jack in the Box. Now they're residing in Southern California. In some Arizona, I guess. Starbucks just trying to get rid of them. Captain D's a thorn in everyone's side. Are they officially done now? I don't have any uh, straight up answer for that. But it looks like it's between Starbucks and Five Guys. So if these fast food chains assembled armies, would it be Starbucks and Five Guys? Very interesting. The baristas versus the guys. And uh, the five guys having the advantage currently. Starbucks is done. So there you have it. Shout out to five guys, a fast food chain that I've personally never had. Um, they took control of the nation. 32 chains. Five guys by far not the biggest fast food chain. But they were able to pull it off. So like if you like this video, if you want to see this simulation ran again, if you want to see uh, your fast food chain maybe have a shot at it, uh, let me know and I'll run it up again if this video does really well. If not, I'll do it uh, sometime later down the road maybe. But uh, subscribe if you want to see more of these simulations or other um, product related uh, videos food reviews, outdoor videos, I don't know. This one was kind of wild. It kind of got crazy in the second half. But without further ado, y'all, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Southern Woods out.